ran in your Johnny Club last week and then made your debut against Portsmouth at the weekend. How have you found it so far? Yeah, obviously it's been great. Um, all the lads have been top notch for me since since I come on uh, Friday when I trained there, uh, and then straight in on Saturday to make my debut. Uh, a bit nervous at the start, but you know you grow you grow with confidence as the game goes on. And I, I think you know I've done done all right, and I think when it was a narrow defeat on another day, you know would have got some out of the game. Yeah, what did you make of the Portsmouth game? Like you say, there we we were in the game for the majority of it and just unlucky to, to be beaten. Yeah, um, obviously it's a sloppy goal to concede and we know that. But I feel like, you know, we did we did the club proud. Uh, we fight to the final whistle and on another day, like I say, their keepers pulled off a few good saves and we'll get some out of the game. From your perspective, it must be pleasing to come straight in and, and get 90 minutes under your belt. Yeah, exactly what, exactly what I wanted. Um, when I, I've agreed to come here on London, you know, it's a perfect environment for me to come in and try and work hard to get as many games as I can under the belt between now and the end of the season. I think it's a good place for me to learn, uh, especially as a young lad. Pretty much perfect for me to get as many games as I can. I'm guessing one of the main objectives for you is to, to come and establish your place in the team in that left back position. Yeah, that would be nice. Um, you know, I'll be working so hard and training every day uh, in games. You know, not not only for myself obviously, but for the team massively. I uh, feel like we've got a good change room where everyone wants to work work hard for each other. And that's that's what I want to carry on bringing. You turned twenty last month. Is it important for you to to be playing regular football at the rate the age that you're at now? Yeah, um, obviously, I'm still young, still twenty, but. In football, you know, it's a short career. Uh, it's good to get as many games as young as, as young as possible. You know, a lot of the best players start off when they're 16, 17 to get as many games, and that and that's what deny excels the career. And I think getting games now regularly, week in week out, would be would be great for me. We obviously saw you in action against Portsmouth, but can you tell us a little bit more about the type of player that you are? Um, obviously, I'm not a very tall player, so I'm quite quite aggressive, you know, I like to like to let them know let the winger know that I'm there and you know I like to think that I'm calm on the ball, try and attack when I can but also you know do my defensive duties which is the main thing as a defender. It seemed like you're pretty highly rated at Hull City so I'm guessing this is a big opportunity for you to come here, develop and then potentially go back and, and, and get in the first team there. Yeah um, obviously towards the beginning of this season I had a, a little spell in the team at Hull but you know, it's a it's a tough tough league it's a championship. It's a tough team. You know, to keep me placing, especially with the quality we've got in the dressing room at Hull. So I think you know to come here and try and try and cement that spot left back, get as many games as I can, and then obviously there's there's a lot for me to learn. Uh, it'll only benefit me as a player to to then at the end of the season go back to Hull and try and push to play games there as well. Yeah, I believe you've made seven appearances for Hull this season. What, what have you made to the season so far and playing at that level? Um, you know, I think you just take, take each game as it comes there. Uh, it's, it's difficult, you know, the quality of players that you're playing against. It's it's tough, but I think, I think I've done well when I played at Hull. Uh, um, yeah, so, yeah. How have you found your time working with Keith Hill and David Whitcroft so far? Yeah, I think the demand from the players, which is exactly what I want, uh, I want to be pushed, you know, every day uh, to try and get the best out of myself. And I think that's what they'll, they'll do for me. Presumably you're starting to get to know your teammates a bit more too. How have they been with you since you joined? Yeah, they've welcomed me, you know, uh, getting to know a few of the lads now. Uh, but yeah, they're all spot on there. Uh, made it a lot easier for me, you know, it's sometimes well it's daunting to go into a change room where you don't know anyone and yeah, I'm happy with the way that they've welcomed me. A bit of a gap now in the in the fixture list before our next game against Bristol Rovers, you must be very much looking forward to, to being involved in that one. Yeah, um, can't come quick enough really, you know, after playing on Saturday you just want the games to come quick and fast, so yeah, looking forward to the next game. Does the nature of the situation at the club 
is in actors something that you can learn from as a young footballer? Yeah, um, obviously the club's trying to rebuild, you know, uh, and I think you know it's a great great opportunity for me to come and learn and you know play and get get games and it's just all learning curve really. What were your thoughts then when you when you first heard about Bolton's interest? Yeah, it was a no brainer really. Uh, but the, well, the manager at Hull spoke to me and said uh, Bolton are interested uh, around me when I was at home and he said, do you know, it's, it's up to you and I straight away said, yeah, uh, get me there really as quick as possible and, you know, that was on the Tuesday night and then on the Thursday I did my medical and then I went to train Friday, so, yeah, I was delighted. Yeah, what did Grant McCann say to you before you came here? Is he kind of encourage you to, to learn as much as you can and, and pick up as much as you can from the surroundings and the things yeah, around Yeah, um, I think he he wanted me to come and, you know, get get some games under my belt and so do I and he just said just play like like you do and train like you do and you'll be fine. So you know, that's that's the only advice I needed really. Just finally you must be looking forward to the fight ahead and the remainder of the season and what's in stock. Yeah, obviously we'll, we'll fight to the end. Uh, I know that the rest of the lads will also fight to the end. So looking forward to each game as it comes, and we'll give everything. And if we fall short, then we fall short. But you know, we'll all give everything.